Ladies and gentlemen, you join me at 10 to 7 on a cold, wet Tuesday morning. But, my God, is this going to be some Tuesday? So that's currently the settings outside. However, I am about to get in a car to go all the way to Milton Keynes to collect something very, very special. So, I'm going to leave you in a little bit of mystery and get in a car and head up to Milton Keynes from my house. Let's go. Yuck. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm here at Urban and Yanomai's with the men responsible for the car. Uh, Lenny's in the background there, lovely jubbly. I'm gonna show you it right now, okay? I'm gonna flip my little crazy stick. Here we go, boom! Wow! Look at my car. Oh, I'm gonna get all the angles for you. Look at the kit on the sides. The back is to die for. Earth, earth, look at that. <laughs> The wheels are crazy. The air freshener is just as crazy. <laughs> if anyone didn't know, that is the air freshener. But holy smokes, what a car that is. Everyone was saying that the air freshener did get a lot of attention whilst they was doing the car. Yeah, I hope they enjoyed that. Big up, you guys. Thank you very much for this. Absolutely amazing. How many years ago was the GTR? I don't even know. I don't know. That's that's an oof motor though. Look it. Look. Time to take her home. Here she is getting wet outside. <laughs> I've missed this car so much. Oh my God. And it looks like this. All right, we are in the whip. It's time to take this home. We'll get Faith's reaction. Holy smokes. This is mental. <laughs> oh yes. An hour 40 of driving this home. Oh baby, let's do it man, let's do it. All right, ladies and gents, we're back home. Terminal. All oh, right, okay. Home town. Uh, Faith's been recording a video and trying to do a Jamaican accent. So yeah. it's been away for three weeks, hasn't it? Yeah. That's because basically the kit that I chose, they don't have it all the time. They have to custom make it. So are you ready? Three, two, one. Oh, wow. Whoa, that's so cool. Whose car's running? Yours. Mine? Yeah. Why is my car running? I don't know. Did I leave the keys in there? Where the fuck are my keys? What I don't, have you done? I don't know. Why is your car running? Don't know, but I better go catch it. <laughs> no, no, I actually am a big fan. I really like it. It's really it's nice. matchy matchy. Sort of matchy matchy. You're going to change the other one, aren't you? Like yeah. It's like three gradients darker. Wow, I'm a fan. Come and show me, where's it? Where's that carbon thing? The side steps done. Oh, here. I see. That's done. The wheel arches are done. Oh, nice. Wheel yeah, that's now. actually really cool. Oh yeah, that it's looks good. 24 inches of beautifulness. Yeah, they're they're looking meaty. I enjoy that. Not and it's good. not really annoying you the fact that it's kind of the same colour, but it's not really. It's very expensive. You're a rich man. <laughs> <laughs> wow, yeah. I can write my name in this one. No, no, there's no need to put it like that, is it? No, 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 no. There is my brand new car. My two car garage. Oh, could this be a cool thumbnail shot? Ah, wow, ah, oh, wow, whose car's that? Oh, wow, it's mine. Do you want me to do a Bazinga reaction? Oh, oh, wow, oh, that's, oh, that's so cold, what, bruv, wow. Wagwan, my little bum sniffs. I don't know what that was. Anyway, you're not a bum sniff, you're a very lovely person. We are back, pow, in the gym. I don't really know what's happening. I've had an energy drink, so we are kicking off. I've been away for a side men's shoot for the last two days. So the last time you saw me, I was picking up my car. The weather is now nice in the UK, and guess what? I have new gym attachments. We we have close grip for rowing and also pulling downwards. More emphasis on the places that we want it in. We have a multi-use attachment. So I can pull down with this. I can do curls with this. I can press overhead with this. I can do loads of things with this. But yes, ladies and gentlemen, it feels good to be back. Uh, we are gonna hit a pull day session. So that means pull-ups, lat pull-downs, some rubbing, some biceps, all the things that matter in life we are going to hit. I'm going to post on my Instagram story, if you don't follow me over there already, please do, for some questions. And I'm going to answer questions whilst I train. So how about that? Let's do it. We are gonna do a nice little incline warm-up uh, to get the blood flowing. Then we will start training. All righty, warm up complete. Time to get into the first set, which is pull ups. Let's get it.
First set done. What I'm trying to do at the minute is actually like focus on my form a lot more and sort of making sure all the reps are, I'm sort of just dialing things all the way back to square one again because I want to restart and refresh. So the form I'm trying to tighten up, the time under tension, using the correct muscles, not momentum and stuff like that. So that's what we're trying to do at the minute. First question, we'll start off on a lighthearted one. How's FPL coming along? I am shit. I'm so bad, so, so bad. It's looking like it's gonna be another season of a loss for Bazinga. I've lost two previous seasons. I've been in the bottom two. However, this time we've got JJ and Kallux, so it's a bottom three, and it's me, KSI, and Kallux fighting it out. So who knows, maybe a miracle can save me and I can drag Theo Baker in, but it's not looking pretty. So I think we got eight, eight clean reps of that uh, on the pull-ups over there. So next set, hopefully we can get close to that again. Car vlogs when uh, right now. This video has my other car in it, so boom. And in brackets, it said with Matt Armstrong or anyone really. Yes, Matt actually commented on one of my recent videos. Buzzing, how cool, because I watch him rebuild cars and stuff. I've got no clue how to rebuild a car, but it's fascinating. What do you and Faith get up to when Olive is having a nap? Well, for example, today I am currently in the gym right now as Olive's gone down for her nap. So it's a good time to sort of like get in a gym session or if it's Faith, she often will go and play with the horses, something like that. So yeah, that's what happens. All right, we're moving over to the cables because next up we are going to do a sat down variation of the lap pull down. Uh, we'll answer one more question before we get on the lap pull downs. A lot, of, a lot of questions are just about how is Olive? Olive is amazing. Olive is growing up like alarmingly quick. She is so smart. It's just amazing. Like I hate being away from her. When we do travel and stuff like that, I hate being away from both Faith and Olive. Like I, I actually love being at home with them. Proper wholesome, really cute. Yeah, man, she's she's starting to string words together properly now. Like she'll sit there and say like, hiya daddy, daddy, da da da, daddy Peppa Pig. She can she does like this funny snort at the minute. She can't figure out how to snort through her nose. So she just makes a noise with her mouth. Like she'll be sat there and the Peppa Pig theme song will come on for example. And she'll go, Peppa pig but she, she does it with her mouth so yeah man she's growing up really quickly uh proud dad Do you take uh, creatine every day? Yes, that is one of the most researched supplements, so definitely get that involved if you are training. Are the Mighty Hammers gonna get past Bayern Leverkusen? It's gonna be tough. They haven't lost in 37 fixtures. They've got a couple of draws in there, but listen, if there's any destroyer of current modern football, it's David Moyes, so viva la Moyes, Moyes in, let's cook. Someone said, what are your current goals slash fitness gym sort of things? Right now, it is literally just stripping things back to bare basics and enjoying my sessions, because I feel like you can get a little bit too regimented, lose the fun in it, so at the minute, I just sort of come down here, mix it up, chop it up, chuck some weight on, track it for every session to make sure that I'm progressively overloading it. And just have fun with it again, but also tighten up form because I feel like you can get into bad habits over the years of training. All right, coming up next, we have got Cable Rose with the new attachment, the close grip attachment. Lovely, jubbly, let's get it. However, before we get started on that one, uh, we've got a question coming in from Fizzle K. And Fizzle K says, what should I wear on the 30th? And as I've told you many a times, just dress up, look nice. Planning a little surprise for Fizzle K. So on the 30th, be prepared. Oh yes, it feels so good. Someone said, what is your current PRs? Basically, I haven't done a one rep max video in God knows how long. Not even a video, just I haven't done a one rep max in like so long. So let me know if you'd like to see a video based on what my current one rep maxes are, just purely because I did change up my training. I'm training as if I want to get big again now because it's sort of what I enjoy doing. But I did swap over to being sort of like, athletically fit. So I do think my numbers will have gone down from before. Do you do a cheat day? Yes, pretty much. Every Saturday is like takeaway day in a house. Sometimes though, it's not even that naughty. Sometimes we just get like a chicken chish, which is just chicken with rice or chips. So it's not even that bad, but it's nice to have as a sort of like a takeaway day with the family. Uh, do you want to have another kid in the next five years? Yes. The aim is to have two or three all pretty close together. So listen here, Bez is, uh, is going to be a papa, a big papa. If you could get rid of Faith's horses instantly, would you? No, because I believe everybody needs their sort of fun in their relationship. That is sort of Faith's fun. She's done that way before she knew me. That's her sort of hobby. She gets to get out and be herself with that. So absolutely not. I think it's necessary. That's exactly why sort of we bought this property anyway, so that we can both enjoy our lives as individuals as well. All right, the next exit exercise is, I don't even know what they're called. They're just like sort of assisted pull-ups to the bar, um, but very calisthenics based, but a really good contraction on your back and um, very good for building strength in your back. So uh, we're gonna set up and do that right now. Nice grip. 
Also, those are like a, a great alternative. If you can't do pull-ups currently, these are a great alternative to sort of build up the strength to eventually do it, a body weight pull-up. You're gonna keep your hair blonde, fuck it, man. I'm just sort of living through it, experiencing it. Who knows, maybe I'll do it again. But yeah, I think the trim's actually come out pretty cold. It had to take like two weeks to mature for people to see the vision, but I think everyone saw it in the end. So, we ever do another marathon series. Remember guys, I'm running the London Landmarks Half Marathon in April. The donation page is over there, somewhere on one half of the screen. Um, remember, you can get involved. We've already beaten the target, but hoping to raise some more, so, and I will be filming the whole thing. How do you balance work, gym, and being a dad? It's a very fine sort of line. Obviously, the sideman schedule can be hectic, especially when we're traveling, and I do feel quite a lot of weight on my shoulders when, uh, for example, Faith is doing it all by herself. I, I'm, I'm not a fan of it, um, besides what some people may think. But um, yeah, it's not ideal. I do wish I could be at home and help out. But gym as well, gym can also take a back burner. Sometimes things are more important than just getting a good pump in or whatever. So yeah, you have to realize what your priorities are and, and where they fall into place. Progressive overload, one more rep than last week. I'll tell you what I am gonna do now though, because this session's a little bit stop-starty, I'm gonna finish this session and then answer the rest of the questions inside or once I finish. So, bosh, let's get this workout finished. I know it's coming back to my car, but basically they they were cleaned yesterday whilst I was out of the country. So they are looking also spectacular today. So I'm gonna give you a quick tour around in good lighting and show you the car in its full glory. So hopefully the camera's picking up in this lighting, but forged carbon is essentially just not, it's not got the classic carbon pattern. The tires shine with the brand new wheel arches. The sidestep is just looking gorgeous. Little urban logo down there. But look at these wheels, man. I can't get over that the fact that it's in my car. This is my vehicle. And of course, the big bad boy spoiler out here. Like This is how it should look when it comes out of the factory. Do you know what I mean? But look at that. It's just a thing of beauty, man. Just a thing of absolute beauty. Forged carbon lip at the front. Woof. Absolutely fire. The color as well. The color is just phenomenal. The color is just phenomenal. The, the GTR also got a bit of a polish up yesterday as well. She's looking absolutely phenomenal. Look at the shine on her. Get right in there, Michavi. The wheels of the GTR looking good. This is a good example as well. So look, the, the GTR has got a matte carbon body kit. So as you can see here, that's carbon fiber. Some two car driveway that is, my friends. Believe me when I say this all wouldn't be possible if you guys hadn't supported me and the boys over like the last 10 years or so. So genuinely, I can never express my gratitude enough to you lot. Yeah, every day feels like a fever dream. Thank you for helping me provide for my family and being happy in general and all the other extra luxuries in life that I suppose come with this thing. But yeah, man, thank you. Big up yourselves. Appreciate you as always. And um, I'll catch you in the next video. See you later.